So how does it work? Basically, you can add in any text you want and you can design it using a combination of different CSS. So you can use different fonts, um, which is extremely to use. It works with Google fonts as well. So if I wanted to change the font completely, I can find a custom font on Google and just load it up straight away. Uh, you can change the font size, the line height, the line spacing, the color, the opacity. If you want it to be slightly see-through, you can change the font weight as well. So if you wanted it thinner, as you can see, I like it nice and thick and you can change it to italic if you want. Obviously we're gonna keep it normal. Um, but that's not where we stopped. We wanted to go even more advanced. So we decided to add rotation. So you can actually rotate the text. You can also rotate it sideways to add like a depth of field effect which is obviously extremely cool. There's nothing on the market which kind of gives you this much control on a drag and drop interface. And you can also rotate things. So there's massive amounts of functionality that you can use just using uh, the built-in features and functionality. Of course, we've added more. You can add in your own borders, your own radius. So if I wanted to add a 50 pixel radius, got it in a nice circle, looks like a road sign. Um, there really is massive amounts of flexibility. We can add in different styles of borders if we wanted a dotted border or a dashed border. Now, this has been a plugin which I've been working on for a long time. So I have managed to make sure that it's got all the features which I knew I needed for my own purposes. And we've recently decided to bring it out to the public and make it available. Obviously, there's a million different features and a million different things you can do with this plugin. It's not just the headlines. So I'm going to show you a couple of the other things that you can do. Let me quickly just show you the timelines and the effects. So as you can see down here, we've got a fade in effect and there's a whole bunch of different effects. You can have it sliding from the left, bouncing from the top, skewing from the right, rotate horizontally, uh, rotate all the way around. We've also added what we call secondary effects. Now these are a different set of effects and they're designed to push back the attention halfway through an animation. So let me show you how that would look. So I've added a secondary effect to this middle headline here. So if I play that, it scrolls in in order, waits a small amount of time, then shakes. So that's great for like a call to action buttons if you want a click here button or something along those lines. Now let me show you how Call to Action Pro actually works um, because there's so many features in this plugin that I can't show you just from one example. Now let's, for example, say you wanted to do a JV sales funnel and we wanted to build one out on a page. Um, here's one I made earlier. So as you can see, I've got uh, three main elements and they're all displayed in a slightly different way. We can also add icons. Um, using Font Awesome, you can add, add in any icon in the font awesome range you can change the color change the size and this just opens up the amount of shapes you can use with our drag and drop interface it really does give you a massive amount of flexibility so let me just show you how this works so these look amazing on jv pages when you want to set up a sales funnel or something along those lines um, and this is just uh touching the tip of the iceberg at the moment so let me go back into cta pro Obviously at the moment you're looking at it and you're thinking, yeah, this is great for sales pages and JV pages, but what else can it do? Well, it can do a hell of a lot, put it that way. So let me show you a custom advert. Now, normally if you want to have adverts on your WordPress blog, they look pretty stagnant. Someone gives you an image, you stick it in the corner. Um, people are, they've just got used to ignoring adverts nowadays, unless there's some kind of motion or attention or something to actually draw their attention to that area of your page, they're not gonna look at it. So I created an advert, I've just got an e-cover, a headline, the click here button. That will animate in just like that. You see the click here button? It's, it's just designed to draw the attention back to that specific area. So this plugin is extremely powerful. Now, let me explain a little bit about how we're going to be selling this. As you can see, there's a whole bunch of different templates and we've got headlines, adverts, testimonials, uh, calendars, follow us on different social networks. Um, that's a really cool one actually, bullets. There, there's a whole bunch of different stuff. Now, 
The main core plugin is going to come with the interface and a selection of about 15 templates. On the upsell, and that will be a single and multi-site license on the front end, on the upsell there's going to be an extension pack where people can purchase extra templates and um, images to import into the plugin. Now this can all be done inside the plugin, it's really simple to use. You just click on um, upload down here and you can upload new templates, graphics and updates or anything that we choose to make available. So as soon as someone purchases the upgrade, they install the normal plugin as usual and then they can come to the update and update or upload their new templates. And it's done, simple as that. Now down here you can see you can load font awesome icons and you can also add in custom fonts from Google Font. So if you go and find a bunch of fonts just for your website to get the right uh, branding correct, you can add them in right here. So after the, uh, the upgrade, the upsell number one, which will be extra templates, we're gonna offer a developer's license. So that's the three stages of our funnel. Now there's nothing like this on the market. You may, you may say, well, it looks similar to a slider, but that's far from the truth. This is designed literally for simplicity, for designing as if you're using something like Photoshop. I am a massive user of Photoshop and I love it, but the fact is Photoshop is not designed to allow you to make your website, well, make it animated, make it look as if it's kind of drawing people and you're, you're kind of making people look where you need them to look when you need that, them to look there. So this is why this plugin was made and um, there's going to be a lot more information coming very soon. We're launching in just over two weeks. Um, I'm busy developing lots of extra templates. If you need a review copy, just hit me up. At the bottom of this page, you will see a little, um, a little animation I designed for Skype, which gives you my, um, 